Josh here and Michelle and we are Adventures, Adventures Ahead. Ahead and today we're going to be talking about Cruise Chatter 13 <laughs> episode 13 and what's the topic uh should you bring your kid kids on a cruise on a cruise um now we have to disclaimer because we don't have any children I've never had any children and Michelle's never had any children not that I know of oh wait <laughs> It doesn't work like that. <laughs> no. So, we don't have any children, so we just know what we've seen on cruises that we've been on. Um, we've been on three. I know that's not a ton. But we have seen a lot of children on the cruises. Yeah. And the interactions and different things like that. So, we are going to... So, first of all, we're going to talk about like what you can do with your children if you do bring them on a cruise. Basically, we're going to say how you get a babysitter on a cruise. Right. And then we'll give our opinions about it after that. And what age we think is a good age for cruising. That's right. So, go ahead and let's run down the <clears throat> list of things we have here. Okay, so the first thing that they have for kids on Carnival is called Camp Carnival. So, that's for ages 2 to 11. Uh, within that age range, they do some different age groups. Let me also say this, that this is for Carnival. Carnival. So, we should have said that. Carnival Cruise. That's all we've ever cruised now. Right, so that's what we stick with, Carnival. Like, we're, we don't know Royal Caribbean things. No, or, this is for Carnival. So, yeah, we'll put that in the title as well. So, they have three different age gr ranges in there. Uh, two to five, six to eight, and then nine to eleven. So, okay, so Carnival. Uh... Now, when we were on the ship, I have seen, I think we were eating in the Lido Buffet, mm -hmm. and I did see they had like a blocked off area, and they had a bunch of kids in there, and they were like eating hot dogs and all this kind of stuff. Cheese. Yeah. Stuff like that. Um, I did see that, because we kind of sat next to that area. Yeah. Because at first I went up and I said, why is this blocked off with chairs? But it's because they were bringing the kids in. So. And that, they looked young. Like. Yeah. Like four or five years old, something like that. Yep. So they're broken up into age groups. Uh, so during the day, they have different activities that kids can participate in, uh, or you can keep them with you. But right. these are this is just what Carnival offers. Um, they also have this program for the Night Owls group for this age range. Uh, it's from 10 p.m. to 1 a.m. and it's 6.75 each child plus an hour. A 15% gratuity, and that's per hour. So Right, so if you want to go out and party in the casino or at a bar or go see a late show, it's going to cost you extra if you got a kid. Yeah, and then your kids have to sleep on the floor. They don't have cots or anything. <laughs> and stuff. So yeah, so if you want to go out and party, you it's going to cost you. So your, your kids can get watched by uh, a member of the staff yep. or more. Uh, and then there was something on Carnival's website that says any child left after 1 a.m. is going to get charged double. So you're going to get charged double for that. And then also you're, you can't participate in Night Owls the rest of the crew. So if on the first night you, you get drunk and forget about your kid. Yeah, and you like are at the casino till 5 in the morning. You, you're out of here. Uh, yeah, you're not going to be able to do it the rest of the cruise. Yeah. So the next age group is what, Michelle? Circle C. So this age range is from 12 years old to 14 years old. Um, and basically they have some activities while there are port days and activities while there's um, sea days. Now this is the room that I think I always walk by and they got like Games. Playstations and um, other video game systems hooked up. I think they might... I don't know if they have any computers or anything in there. I don't know. But I know they have, like, and they have other different games I can play in there and stuff oh, yeah. like that. Oh, yeah, they have also th some themed nights. Those are cost extra, but they have some themed nights. Okay, and then what's and the then next And then the last day? one is Club O2, and that's for 15 to 17-year-olds. Uh, and those activities run till 1230 in the morning. Cool. Um, and they also have some port day activities. And they also have, like, their own nightclub area almost. Oh, yeah, they do. Yeah, so. I don't want to see little kids, like, doing that kind of stuff. Just partying. Like, I know like how little kids dance. Verdi <laughs> 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 so, this other thing that Michelle told me I was very uh, surprised we by. You could leave your kids on the ship while you're in port in, like, the Camp Carnival area. I don't know if that's a pay or not because I didn't do my research on that. But it really surprised me that you could leave your kid 
on, on a the cruise ship while you're in a different country. And you're, like, you're in a port. So that's interesting. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if I would do that. Oh, I'd probably feel comfortable. Mm. I'm like, hey, I'm going to party on the land, man. I'll come back all drunk. <laughs> so anyway, that's what Carnival offers for kid activities. Kid, uh, different kid groups. Yeah. Okay, so, so... Josh, tell me what you think about bringing kids on a cruise. I'm against it. Well, so I'm gonna be, kids? I'm going to be clear about this. I'm very against it. Uh, no, not all kids. Okay. I'd say if your kids circle C age, 12 and older, that's fine. But I'd say younger kids like that, no, that, that's not for me. Especially the young, young ones. If it's between the age of born to like, I'd say seven. like six or seven, I'm sorry. I, I just don't agree with that. Because, I mean, I, I just don't, um, yeah, I wouldn't. I personally would not want to bring a child that age on a cruise. Um, especially, and uh, really, the ones that are so little that they don't know what's going on. Like, what is the purpose of bringing that child on a cruise? Like, maybe, you know, five, six, seven, maybe they might get some enjoyment out of it. But I'm talking under about... Under five, no. Right, like, under five, like, I just don't see the purpose. And we've talked to people on the ship that had babies. Diapers. Like, what... Like, seriously, why? I, I don't get it. I just don't understand it. Like I said, I do not have children, so I don't know. But, and then I've also had people tell me the argument of, well, if we couldn't bring our child, we couldn't go on vacation. Well, I just wouldn't go on vacation. I, I, on a cruise. On a cruise. We'd probably pick something else. Right. I would say, I don't, How do you feel? I personally probably wouldn't bring a kid under 10 either i understand why people bring kids from that five to ten age range though so i get that i don't understand the under five though under five yeah like so, let us know if you <laughs> bring your child that's from born to five on a on a from like zero to five on a cruise um be interested to hear what you have to say about that um i'm i think the ideal age would be yeah. 10 or older. Right, yeah, really. 10 or older. Um, I, I would feel more comfortable at 12 if I had a kid. Sure, sure. <laughs> a lot more. And I feel like you're getting your money's worth out of it as well for that child. Like, they can experience different things. And, and they'll remember that stuff too, right? Sure. So I think, you know, that's... Josh and I never went on a cruise before I was like 29. And yeah, I was like 30-something, 30 30? 32 or 33. Yeah, and we're not saying 32. that... If we had kids, we wouldn't, I guess, we would, I don't know. I don't know what I'm trying to say, actually. I'm just trying to tell you that I just don't understand, like, that people are carrying around babies in strollers and stuff, and pushing babies in strollers, and, like, I've seen some dads, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not lying here. I've seen some dads, like, strolling their kids, and they're going by the casino or a bar, and they just look at it like they wish they could be there instead of pushing their little kid around. Well, we've seen kids in the casino. We've seen kids in the casino, too. Yeah, I don't agree while with that. While their dad's smoking cigarettes. Yeah, and holding them and, and working a slot machine. <laughs> yeah. Seriously, I saw that late night Twice. in the casino. Yep. <laughs> uh, I tell Michelle, maybe they're from a different country or something. Anyway. I don't know. But yeah, so that's how we feel about it. It's not that we dislike kids. Don't 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 get no, us wrong. No, I like kids a lot. We joke around about <laughs> disliking children. We don't. We but like we kids. Don't. Uh, we like kids, but we just don't have any of our own. But we just don't understand why you'd bring one that young on a cruise. So I guess what we're asking is for you guys to, if you do bring your young child, let us know, like... Why? Yeah. We're just trying to gain understanding, I think. Sure, and we're just giving our opinions on the matter yeah. as well. Right now, we're ignorant, so... I wouldn't say that. I've seen... Uh -oh. Like I said, I've seen people how they are with children, and like I said, I feel like they wish they could be doing something else besides strolling a kid around when they could be having Drinks. different kind of fun on a ship. That's all I'm saying. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Cool. Thanks for watching. Like, like comment, comment, subscribe. subscribe. Hit that bell notification for more... <sighs> We're going to have some more hot topic uh, op, uh, things to talk about here on this channel. We have, and sometimes we have different <laughs> viewpoints than a lot of different people. And so and you it might what? get people talking. And you know what? Other people are going to have our viewpoints too. We understand that. And um, you know what? We like to have different viewpoints. If everybody thought the same, how boring would life be, right? And that's right. 
Okay. Okay. Join us on Facebook group, uh, Adventures Ahead Cruising group. And that's all, folks. Okay. See ya. Bye. Bye.